about right. And let's add our character. So I'm going to use a first person uh, controller for this. You can use your own custom character, it doesn't really make a difference. Move him up a little bit. And that's that. Okay, so now we have a basic scene. Uh, and we're going to need an object for our point system. So uh, I've got a pre made coin here. Uh, so I'm just going to add that. Oops, looks like it's missing. Uh, shoot. Uh, let's just go with the. We'll just go with the. Like, a, a sphere. Why not? Size that down. Looks about right. Okay, so now we have a point for our character to pick up. So uh, now we're going to have to create some JavaScript. So we're going to go down to create. JavaScript, and we're going to name it point sys, and double click to open. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we need to accomplish is we need to have some variables. So, uh, first thing we're going to do is variable, uh, let's just call it score, player score. Uh, that's going to be an integer. Uh, this is just like the number, integer means number, player score is what our score is going to be, so that's going to be a number, then var, uh, sco not soccer, S score text, which is going to be, uh, uh, it should be an equal sign, now, what this is, this is the text that's going to be displayed on the screen. So, yeah, that's what that is. Um, hold on a sec. Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry, I had to set a timer so I don't go over the time limit. Uh, what this is going to do is this is the text that's going to be displayed on our screen. So, um, score equals zero. So that's what it's going to start off with. And we're going to have to have uh, max points. Uh, max points is just like the maximum points we're going to have before something happens. So, moving on from there, we're going to go to function on trigger enter other. Uh, now, what this does is whenever we walk into a trigger, which was is going to be our uh, coin object, then it's going to do something. And we're going to go if other dot tag equals point uh, what this does is it says if our other which would be our point is tagged uh, as point then uh, we're gonna do player score which is our number plus or equal to one and we're gonna do uh, score text Whoops, score text equals score space. Oops, we need a parentheses there. And then we're going to do uh, plus player score. That's going to add our player score to our score text. Uh, from then on, we're going to go to uh, destroy. Uh, other dot game object that should not be caps and then we're going to uh, close that off whoops and close the whole thing off okay now let's save this and check for errors uh, yep looks like we got an error Forgot to put parentheses there. And we're all good. So uh, let's just take our point. Should be called point. And we're gonna make it a trigger. Then we're gonna go to tags up here and add tag. Tags are just like uh, 
basically names you can add to objects so you can identify them later. Uh, you're going to go to size, make it 2, and then click right here and add point. I already did that, but just like that. And then go back over to your point object, tag, point, and uh, drag our point system script onto our character, and hit play. And actually before we do that, we should go to, uh, we should delete our main camera so we don't get the error anymore. And we should go over here so we can see our score. Okay, now let's walk onto a point and see what happens. Okay, our player score over on the left is now 1, or on the right actually. Score text is score equals 1, and our max points we have it set to 0. So, looks like that part's working. Uh, just hold on a second. So we're going to go back to our script, and we're going to add, uh, let's see, function update. Ah, uh, silly me. Function update if player score, which is our number of points, is greater than our max points, then we uh, change our player score to zero and uh, print uh, max reached. You can put whatever you want there, it doesn't really matter. Uh, and then we're going to do that. That, and save it, check for errors. Always check for errors. Nope, looks like we're all good there. So, uh, now let's change our max, max points to 1 and see what happens. Or actually, we have to change it to 0 because it's greater than. and walk into it and you can see over here it says max reached uh, our player score has reset to zero uh, we still need to reset our player score so we'll do that right now so uh, we're gonna do uh, let's see I'm not sure if this will actually work score text equals score zero or no, actually, uh, yeah, okay, let's hope that works. Okay, now let's try it. Okay, max reach, point zero, score zero, looks good. Uh, so uh, that's it for this part. Uh, go to part two and we'll actually make it show up on screen and a whole bunch of other stuff. Just make it better. So uh, hope you enjoyed it. Rate, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Halo Hacker. I'll put that in the description. Uh, see you later.